We are here at Koi Elementary to follow up on a grant that was received by Mrs. Kujawa. Let's go ahead and see what's going on in her classroom. I applied for a grant where we were purchasing sewing machines. Um, the other two elementary buildings already had sewing in their classrooms and in their steam labs. So I wanted to make sure that Koi also did that. Um, and I just wanted to get like sewing in here. We purchased stuffing, we purchased ironing. We also purchased pillows, um, lots of fabric, any supplies like thread, needles, bobbins, pins, and also four of our sewing machines were purchased through uh, those funds. We made two pillows initially, um, and we made a small one in class. The smaller one was probably about four or five inches. And we did that all together as a whole group. Um, and the kids were so excited. They just thought that that was the best thing ever. Some of them even were being really selfless and they were gonna give it away and donate it to like a parent or give it to grandma for her birthday. Uh, so that was amazing. These are going to be going to the landings in Oregon. Um, these are a higher level skill. The students actually have to sew two different panels and, the, and then the front panel and then stuff it with a, a filling stuffer pillow. Um, one of the things that was super hard on this is they had to do a straight line. As you can see, they're not exactly perfect, but they have done a really nice job with that. Um, they've come a long way. Sewing, I think, is a really great thing for kids to learn because I'm thinking about maybe in my later future, since I have a lot of family members and relatives who have sewed things like clothing and all sorts of things. I want to do stuff like that when I grow up. Thank you for your support. Um, <clears throat> what you do and how much money that you give to the schools is amazing. The students absolutely love it and you'll see it on their faces and um, when you get to see them in sewing club. But the one thing that it does for everyone is there's skills that you can't teach in a reading lesson or math lesson. And when they can come to STEAM or they can come to our sewing club and learn all of those life skills, that's what the foundation is doing.